Peacheronies, welcome back to a new video. If you're in the stream, hello, continued hello. Welcome back to another stream, another video. I hope you guys are feeling peachy and your day is peachy as well. We are gonna be playing some Sims today and we're gonna be doing uh, one of our favorite challenges, which is old characters, new CC. We bring characters back into their prime and we give them a whole new look based on the new CC I have in the game now. So I'm just gonna go ahead and save these guys as the Twins and Caden, which, oh well, uh, which is who we're gonna be doing today. It was originally the Twins and Luna, but these guys make a much better trio because obviously they are all part of the same set. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and save those to my lap gallery and then add them again so we can do a little bit of a compare and contrast too. Um, and the next set I think we will do is we will probably do, um, I don't want to give Raven new CC, I think she's fine. So I think we'll do Phoenix, we will do Fran, and we will also do Luna because she's kind of been left out. We need to give her some new CC as well. So hopefully you guys are going to enjoy today's video. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and, oh, also, if you are on YouTube, can I just share with you guys our newest little friendo? I kind of want him just everywhere with me all the time. So you know what? This is my Babel. Let's go back into the game. Babel, you can come along and watch, okay? Let's just make you... I'm gonna turn you the other way so you look like you're watching. Just do a little flip, there we go. And you just, just come hang out with me here. You just come out, Abel, okay? You would just come along for the ride, that's fine. I don't, I <laughs> no, we won't, we won't, we won't. Put you back up there. And also, uh, a big shout out to people who have been amazing in today's stream so far. Um, Aussie Romantic and Alone Gremson and Marilyn A have all been amazing gifters, but Ozzy in particular, thank you so, so much. You are awesome. Okay, let's kick off today's video. Are you guys excited? I've got the stream um, helping me out in the background, um, giving me some advice on what they want to see as well. So let's just, I'm going to go ahead and strip everything off for now. So I'm a bit worried about these guys. Uh, the music's so loud in my ears. So weird, like, but if I switch it down, would it completely goes off? And I won't be able to hear if you guys do anything. It's fine, okay. So, the reason I'm a bit worried about these guys is honestly, they kind of have, I don't know, they have kind of strange appearances in some ways. Like, they just, like, they've got very narrow heads and they definitely suffer from my lack of chin that many of my sims seem to suffer from. Um, so I am just a little bit worried about trying to make them look good, but we'll give it everything we can, okay? Rachel Peach has just subscribed. Welcome to the Peach Squad. Welcome to the Peach Squad. Okay. Um, so we've had pretty good success with this so far, so I'm hoping we're going to do the same for these guys. I was kind of thinking maybe because they've got thinner heads, they'd suit thinner eyebrows, but <laughs> maybe not. Um, and I need to get some new looks for them. I've seen you guys share like pictures of these two that you guys have done on your games and you've redressed them. You've done a much better job than I ever did. So I'm kind of low-key thinking I need to try and get some inspiration from you guys because I always found these two really difficult. But some of you guys have created some amazing versions of them. So I'm kind of looking to your guys' help and advice for these two. Because I always just found them kind of hard. I definitely found them sort of hard to get to look right. I'm like, I can't even find an eyebrow that suits her. This is so weird for me because usually my sims just look, I put some eyebrows on and it's like, oh yes, perfect, done. But these two I've always found really, really hard. See, uh, Sierra Nicole, welcome to the Peach Squad. The real David, welcome to the Peach Squad. What do you guys think? Can you give them chins? This is, I, I almost would, if, if this was now and a, a sim aged up like that, I would give them a chin because I think this is a game bug. I think it's full on a game bug that two things always happen to my sims. They lose their chin and their lips get bigger. And I think it's a game bug because um, when I play around in casts, I sometimes get this on like, um, on challenges and stuff I do, even if the previous generation doesn't have it. So I do think it's a bug, which kind of got a very, there. I think that, We've not given her a big chin, she's still got a very slight chin, but I just think it's maybe a little bit of an improvement to her face shape. Let me know if you guys agree. What about the head widening surgery? That would be kind of doing this. 
What do you guys think? They have got very narrow heads. Why don't we? I always give mine and make their lips smaller. That's what someone in the chat says. Indy is one of my fave sims ever. Is Evie with you? Yeah, la 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 la. Evie, oh. She's by the door. She is here though, she is here. Oh, Meowbox, I just gifted five tier one subs. Meowbox, thank you so, so much, Meowbox20. Big love and hype in the chat to Meowbox20. Okay. I'm kind of thinking that she's got, oh, sorry, my nose is so ready today. Super annoying. So many gifts, I know, right? I feel like it's my birthday. I feel so happy, so grateful. Sorry, I know my nose is running like a craziness. Um, I'm kind of thinking maybe these brows, but maybe a bit darker. Her brow bone's a funny shape because her brow bone is sitting kind of low, which is making a lot of the eyebrows look sort of heavy. And it's giving her a bit of an angry look. So I might just shift her eyebrows up a little bit. And then I think I'm just going to tail them at the ends a little bit more as well. So like a little bit more like this kind of vibe. I don't think that's losing too much of appearance. She definitely has more angular eyebrows. Like they're still a little bit low and angular shaped. But I think she looks better already, right? Len Crip, welcome to the Peach Squad. Um, also, let's, I think often when I started in Skin Details, that is when, that is when the chef kiss occurs. Indy, she does have a few little freckles on her cheeks. Okay, I'm just double checking. Look at the hair it's given her. What, I mean, the hair's, I don't mind it, but it's, it's clay hair. We don't, we don't do that here. They can't sit with us. I do have these new freckles just for like a little bit of an overall freckle. So we've got that option too. Uh, but let's start playing with skin details. I almost feel like these girls don't always suit super realistic ones. I mean, that's kind of cute on her. I don't mind that one. No for that one. It's hot. Sometimes, oh my gosh, no. Some Sims just don't suit like realistic skin details. I think it's when their face shape isn't realistic. That is when you don't get very realistic looking sims. Also, you guys remember, sorry, boobies there. Uh, please remember that for this challenge, I have to give completely new CC. So we won't be reusing any of the um, previous like hair and stuff. The only thing I'm gonna keep on them, I think is the necklaces. Cause if you guys remember, like these necklaces were kind of a big deal for them. Oh, is it romantic? What? You are so generous. Thank you so, so much. What? Sierra Nicole is gifted as well. And oh my gosh, Hannah, Hannah Il Elizad is gifted five subs too. Hannah Elizad, Hannah Elizad, 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 um, pronunciation, wow. Uh, Sierra Nicole, but Aussie Romantic as well. You guys have all gifted subs. Hannah's gifted five, Aussie is gifted five, and Sierra is gifted one. You guys are awesome. Thank you so, so much. Thank you so, so much. Aussie Romantic, you are honestly a hero today. Um, Hero always, always, always. Okay, you guys are saying I have to give them the same skin details. That's a really good point. So, the twins. I'm gonna have to do the same chin changes and the same skin details. And I think that is how we're gonna end up with keeping them looking like identical twins. We accessorize separately, but their actual look itself should be uh, the same. Cause you know, I'm trying to see if, that is very real, isn't it? Uh, they are twins and I want to keep them looking as twins. That is super real. Okay, I kind of am leaning towards Not that one Not that one. Oh little dimples. Not that one. Maybe that Maybe something like that. Just something kind of soft and we'll layer it up. What do you guys think? Yeah, love in the chat Please give some hype up in the chat to our wonderful gifters because they are awesome. They are awesome. Oh man, I feel like this is gonna be the thing where I just keep layering it on and I never know which one to go for. That one's kind of cute as well. I'm thinking if I use skin details that like naturally widen out their faces, then maybe I won't have to give them the head widening surgery. That one's kind of real though. Is it a bit too real? I could give them different eyelids. Cause it is, it is reducing their eyelid quite a lot. Where's my other eyelid? Um, I have an eyelid overlay. Where are you, eyelid overlay? Where are thou? I thought it was here. Still getting, I've added quite a lot of new CC recently. Is it this one? No, they're contacts. <gasps> what? I didn't know I could do that. It's like a heterochromia thing, isn't it? Oh, not noticed you before. The eyes look weird. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to find the eyelid overlays. 
but I cannot find them. Mailbox has gifted another sub as well. Shauna Jade has gifted a sub too. And Ozzy says, last, uh, last not of gifts for now, guys. Love you all and love you, Claire. You do a lot for me in the community. My community is so amazing and it's because of you guys. So thank you so, so much. I can't find the eyelid overlay. <laughs> it's gone. It's gone on holiday and I can't find it anywhere. So we'll go for a different skin that doesn't do the eyelid. Uh, that gives her nicer eyes, I think. Because it doesn't suit her eyes. She's quite heavy lidded. So I kind of feel like we should keep her looking heavy lidded. Sorry, I realize I'm spending so long on this. But it's because it's going to be the same for both twins. So once I figure it out, we'll have both of them, you know? Uh... Just having a little vibe to my music, sorry. Where is the one that we found before? I hate when you click it, it does like that. You know, so you can't see it anymore. It's such a dumb thing to do. Oh, Sims team. What did you guys think of the knitting pack, by the way? Hannah El Elizabeth has given more subs. That's 10 subs. That is amazing. Thank you so, so much, Hannah. Thank you so, so much. Welcome to the Peach Squad, new peaches. Uh, where can we find your CC list? Um, maybe give her a break. That's a good idea. My CC list is, I don't have one anywhere because I've got so much CC that honestly, I, it would just take me all day to try and list all this out. I have thousands and thousands and thousands of CCs. Um, so yeah, I can't give out my CC list and I can't share it the way I used to because I never, oh, wow. Oh wow, that's just like putting full makeup on her, isn't it? Oh my gosh, that's so real. Wow. Not right for her skin tone, but... Wow, look at that! That's like a whole formed person. That's kind of crazy. Wow. Wow. Sorry, I'm just getting really overexcited. Okay, Claire, just make up your freaking mind. Peachy J, welcome to the Peach Squad. Leanne Adams has gifted two subs as well. And Destiny Nicolay has gifted some subs too. The knitting pack seems really cool. They didn't include as much elder stuff as they thought. Yeah, it, it looks like they didn't give us got any like new um, like stuff around the house. Like the plopsy thing looks cool. It's meant to be like Etsy. Like I think that's kind of cool. I don't know. I'm not invested in knitting in any way, shape or form. I know some people are really into it. It's not really for me. Um, so yeah, I'm not too inv invested in knitting. So as a result, I can't find myself getting excited by this pack. For me, knitting should have been something like that should have come with uh, cats and dogs. It's got a really cats and dogs vibe to it. So that as a thing to do should have come with that. I'm thinking I'm going to go for this one on them. No, this one. Yeah, okay. Decision made. Move on, Claire. Move on with your life, Claire. Um, yeah, I kind of feel like it should have come with cats and dogs because it had that kind of vibe to it. So... I, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just not... I'm not very invested in it. Let me know what you guys think. I like the idea of selling your stuff online. I thought that could be kind of cool for Abby, personally. I thought that could be a cool, like... Not Abby. Uh, Ivy. I thought Ivy would be pretty into that, so that would be kind of cool. Um, but, yeah. Not... Not... I don't know. I was a bit underwhelmed. Oh, wow, that, that is a cute nose on her, look. I like that. That's cute. Little mouth corners, so she's looking all happy. Let's go in for the narrower ones, because she's got a narrower head. There we go. Okay. She's looking better already. I think some realistic eyes are going to start help. Ozzy Romantic, Claire, you were the re reason I refound my love for Sims. Watching you made me want to get better and better at making my male Sims. You make amazing male Sims now. Males are hard, but once you get it, like, you get it. Um, Peachy Jade and Haley Depp 6 have just subscribed. Welcome to the Peach Squad. Okay, I think she's looking a bunch better already with what we've put on her. Let's go ahead and just drop some little frecks on her cheeks because she did have those. Do these overlay her skin details if I put these on? Oh, they take off her eyelashes. Okay. Let's just, um, should I make them a little bit frecklier than they were before? Or try some different freckles? Those are kind of cute, across the nose, like that. In my head, because freckles, like, they, they are genetic, but they're also, like, somewhat environmental, too. So I think I'll give them different freckles. I feel like Indy's a little bit more 
outdoorsy, like doing her dancing and stuff outside on the balcony. So I'm going to give her more freckles than I'm going to give Violet, because Violet's a little bit more inside doing her fitness and yoga and all that kind of thing. So that is how I'm going to do that. Uh, could you make another male CC video? That's a good idea. The problem is there's not that much... Um... Oh yeah, Simmer Plays gather does my CC videos. So if you watch Simmer Plays on YouTube, you'll be able to find my CC. Uh, there's not that much male CC. So I don't tend to be able to hold my male CC as much as I do my female CC. Okay, so Indy has indigo eyes. I might make her pupils a bit bigger. Okay, that's option one. And this is like option two. One, two. And then also, what else have we got? I don't usually give these to main series sims. Yeah, they're cool, but they might be just a little bit... I mean, they look awesome, let's face it. They look a little bit fantasy. Ooh, Leanne Richards has used 300 bits for showing some love. Thank you so, so much. Claire, ever thought about making your own CC? I won't even know where to begin with that, but it, it does sound cool. It does sound really cool. I think it's a time thing. Um, I don't... They look kind of cute, too. Oh, wow, but they don't have a purple version. For, I'm just trying to think. Whatever we give her, we're going to have to give Violet as well. So we want to kind of pick from the same pack. And Violet has Violet eyes. So Violet could have these ones and Indy could have these ones and they'll keep looking like twins. Or Violet can have these ones and Indy can have these ones. I think these ones are better. I think I'm gonna go for those. Let's go here. Okay, that's looking so much cuter already. Let's go. What should we, should we do makeups next? Or should we dress her? I know this is a weird way to do things. I, I don't, she's kind of like, sort of more streetwear she's into like her dancing so i feel like she should it should match with that what do you guys think tia loves claire i just want to say thank you claire you've helped me through so many tough times in my health and you've always kept me strong thank you for putting a smile on my face i love you lots thank you so much tia hello from the netherlands Ooh, where are you guys from i always like hearing where you're from you're always like from such uh, varied places that it's really cool it's difficult to set up the Elgato, but I just got one. Oh, that's awesome. Hope you're enjoying your Elgato. It can be tough to get the hang of at first, uh, but then you'll be able to capture all of your gameplay and uh, it's be pretty awesome. Belgium, Germany, Australia, Amsterdam, Montreal, Paris, Slovenia, Sweden, Georgia, Wales, Sheffield, Scotland, uh, New Zealand, South Africa, Czech Republic, Hungary, Harrogate. Uh, Georgia, Sweden, Essex, Dutch, um, Turkey, Rotterdam, Poland, Zimbabwe, what? Uh, Brazil, Finland, Manchester, another from New Zealand, Denmark, Michigan, uh, Virginia, Ohio, uh, Norway, London, Wow, so many places. Leeds! These, these Leeds, hello. <laughs> My brother will appreciate that. I just did that. That's awesome. Thank you guys for tuning in from all over the world. Okay. What kind of makeup should we do on a little indie? Tinkerbell! Welcome to the Peach Squad. Tinkerbell1332. And Lucy has shown some love as well. That's awesome. You guys are from everywhere, which I'm definitely vibing. We're a worldwide community, guys. Worldwide. We're worldwide handsome. Worldwide handsome. That's a BTS thing, sorry. I'm sorry, I know we're not all K-pop stands, but we are on this blessed day. Okay, I'm just gonna try these flicks on her because I'm pulling her face wider with makeup and with skin details and like expanding her face so we don't have to do the surgery. <laughs> that is my logic anyway. It's more like a real life solution rather than a Sims drag in the head solution. It's kind of going for like indigo because it matches her eyes. I think that's accentuating her blue eyes. What do you guys think? Claire, will Abel also be added to the Twitch emotes? So Abel is added to the Twitch emotes. If you are a tier two subscriber, you can use Abel right now. If not, Abel will be released uh, shortly into tier one as well. Tier two subs get to use the um, emotes slightly earlier because I want to do something special to say thank you for those that have subscribed with tier two because it's, it's a level above. Um, 
But then they will get they will release to everyone. They're just gonna go to tier two first. So there you go. I will show you it in the chart so you guys can see how it looks. Where are you, Babel? There you are. Okay. There you go. So if you see anyone using Abel, it's uh it's because they're a tier two subscriber, but they will be released in there, don't worry. Just everything goes um to the tier ones at uh, the tier two subs first. There we go. I, I kind of like the hearts on the cheeks. Is it a little bit wild though? Don't give her blue makeup. I thought it might accentuate her eyes though, and we could give violet violet makeup. Or am I just playing into their names a little bit too much? I don't know. Mm -mm -mm. No, keep orange. Yes to blue makeup. I kind of, if we've got them named after names, we should probably at least try and, you know, play up to it a little bit. It's kind of fun. Oops, did not mean to make her a mermaid there for a second. I do want to make them look different. I kind of feel like Indy would wear more Tumblr makeup, like the little pink nose. And Violet would wear more like, um, like chic kind of makeup. That is the what that's what I'm thinking currently. Actually, I might do this to accentuate a freckles and then I'm gonna go back into skin details and um, see if I can just pop a little bit of a pink nose on here instead. I can do that. Blush, blush, blush. Oh, is this gonna take off a freckles? No. Okay. And then let's go for some lips. Claire, where can you see fun art? I check my Instagram tags. Um, and also I check on my Twitter as well. That is the best place. I have to go, sorry. Don't worry, uh, Shia, Shia Lex. You can catch up with the rest of the stream on my YouTube channel. So don't even worry. Don't even worry. Thank you for coming along. Okay. I'm thinking that looks very cute. I think she looks so much better than she did before. Hair. Let's go ahead and move on to hair because I always found the hair kind of difficult. The reason the hair is difficult is because they've got the narrower head. So because their head is narrower, it's harder to find a style that like works for them. Um, at some points, Indy did have blue hair. I mean, that's kind of the whole vibe right there. That's kind of cute. If not, she tended to wear her hair a bit darker than her sister. So somewhere like here, which kind of suits her brows as well. Which do you guys prefer? I'm not saying we have to go for this hairstyle. I just put it on her and then instantly I was like, that is cute. That is kind of cute, you know? What do you guys think? I like brown. Brown is real cute. Um, we could always go for like a shorter hairstyle on her as well. Uh, don't worry, I will change the colour on these if it's... She never had curly hair, although she does suit curly hair. It's like here, wasn't it? That's with the fringe. If she wanted to really switch apart from her sister and cut a fringe in. Uh, I like the blue plait or the brown plait. They're both kind of cute, aren't they? That's more vi- that, that right there is violet hair to me, so I don't want to do that. However, please let's remember that for Violet because that is a whole mood. That's really cute. Rest restore, restore, restore Sims. Restore Sims has just described. Sorry, I find your name really hard to say. Welcome to the Peach Squad. If you don't know Restore Restore Sims, please check them out in the gallery if you want beautiful men. They make ridiculous ridiculously handsome male sims honestly you're a god at this and i adore the way their their male sims look so so much so definitely check them out in the sims gallery um and you will be drooling over their male sims honestly their male sims are so handsome i have one in my gallery just sat there waiting to use it's the one that you uploaded who wears a hearing aid um oh my gosh I, i'm just waiting for a good opportunity to use them don't worry i've not forgotten about them uh, I kind of like the first hair that we used, but yeah, definitely check them out. Handsome! Handsome guys! Handsome guys. I'm just checking out all of the new hairs I've got to see if any of them suit her, because like I said, 
She's got a difficult to match head shape. That was Faith's, uh, yeah, Faith's hair, so I won't do that one. Kind of very flowy, this one, isn't it? Okay, what do we go for, guys? Oh, see what I mean about the head shape and certain hairs? I honestly think this one kind of worked. I think we, we nailed it at the start, but do we go for blue or brown? I'm going to set it up as a poll. Uh, hair color. So if you are watching on Switch, you get the opportunity to vote on certain stuff. It's just going to be a one minute poll, a super quick poll starting from now. Go ahead and vote, but I, I kind of am digging this. Did she have any piercings? If not, why not? Because I feel like she'd suit a piercing. Wow, she looks so much better already. Like, so much better already. I can't see any piercings, but I might- I'm gonna give... Indy, maybe just one piercing, and then Violet, I'm gonna give her, her... Maybe- maybe Indy has some ear cuffs, and Violet has drop ear, like, piercings, and that's the way that we would do things. She looks like an elf. She does look very elfy, doesn't she? Very, very elfy. Okay, I'm just gonna find a little ear cuff for her while we wait for the results of the poll. I was thinking something like, I need, there needs to be more ear cuff CC. You know, like, like stuff that you just wrap around the top of your ears, because I think that's really cool. Um, oh, your ears are too small for this one, okay. Where's the other one I sometimes use? Giraffe lover, 2268, welcome to the Peach Squad. You guys want brown hair. Me B contributed one, uh, 2,400 channel, channel points. And Danny says, uh, I wonder how you're doing with your hair, Claire. I I go through real phases. The last couple of days I've been I've been better. But the last couple of weeks, if not months, I've been Oh these th this would be Elfias, by the way. <laughs> the last couple of uh, months not so good. I've been really struggling with it. Uh, I'm actually I've I've asked Ali to shave my head, but I don't think he he wants to. Uh but I kind of just want to shave my head again and start again, which I know is kind of extreme. Um, but that's kind of where I'm at at the moment. Um, so yeah, not not the bestest news. Don't mean to put a downer on the chit chat, but where are those ear cuffs? Like seriously, I just want to find the two, the two that go around the top. I've used them so many times. I thought they lived down here, but now I cannot find them. Where is the pole? The pole finished. Brown one. So we're gonna go for brown hair. I'm gonna keep the hair as she is now. I'm really happy with how we've done so far though. Like, I really like her appearance so far. I might just go for this. Kind of like, because she's got kind of difficult shaped ears. So I'm just going to go for these for her little earrings for her. And this is the bit where I'm going to need your guys' help. Dressing. Because we know she's got that kind of street style. Um, and I kind of find it hard to dress girls. So, yeah. I got Emily. <laughs> um, okay. I don't, I mean, this is kind of a cute. Um, oh, we've got this. Not really new, but newer than her. Which is kind of the guide, right? I spend forever making Sims. Same. Honestly, totally the same. It's a bit boobalicious, this, but it's also kind of a whole vibe. I can imagine her wearing something like that. Ooh, with a half and half. Half and half is very cool. Half, I like the half and half. Look, I can put a top underneath this. In my accessories. Um, where are the little tops? Gosh, I can't find stuff today. Yeah, so look. I can cover it up a little bit so she's not quite as people and jubilant. Uh it was a little bit much. So yeah, I could do something like that. That's kind of cute. Nose ring would be cool. Uh yeah, let me try a nose ring out on her. I was a bit cautious about putting piercings on that she didn't have one before, but let's face it, I've done it with other sims. Now, her nose is tiny. So let's see if this even works. Oh, <gasps> It actually does. It's really small, but there is a nose pierce in there. Uh, is this going to be... I want it to come out a little bit more. 
Oh, that for me, it feels like that's on the wrong side. There's no reason for that because like it can go on either side, but something about that on that side just like it feels really off. It's like the opposite direction to what I expected it to be on her face in particular. So where's the other side? Okay, that's the, that's kind of where more where I was expecting. Okay, I think you're right. I think a little nose ring kind of is a whole vibe on her. Maybe gold. There is a smaller one, I think. Maybe silver, actually. Yeah, I think that looks kind of cool. She's kind of got an edgy look about her. Which I really like. She looks so much like Emily. She's like edgy Emily, isn't she? Okay. You know what I need in my game that I really don't have? You know like the cycling style shorts? Like the black shorts that just like come to here and they go like high on your waist? That is what I need. If anyone has CC for that, if anyone knows where to get some really cool ones of those in real life actually, let me know. Um, but I really want the cycling shorts because I thought that would look really cool. Yeah, those jeans are her style, but the top doesn't go with them. But yeah, I want the cycling shorts. What are they called? I don't even know what those kind of shorts are called. Oh, wait a minute. Where are those? This is kind of her vibe, isn't it? I might have to change her top. Because I think I'm going to find it hard to get her top to match. But as soon as I put those short trousers on her, I'm like, yeah, that's kind of her vibe, isn't it? Margaret66, welcome to the Peach God. Bethany has used a little party emo as well. Grim Cookies and Deli Gracie collab. Oh, nice. Okay, I'll check that out. Anyone know where I can get some cool ones in real life, though? Because uh, I kind of want to get on that. I like that look. kind of digging this. Let me just find some shoes for her. Let me know what you think of that so far. Fashion over, you guys are saying fashion over. I'll have to give that a check. I'll have to check that out. Oh man, can you tell I struggle with dressing girls? Because I struggle with dressing girls. I do. I find it harder. <gasps> what about these big things? Oh yeah, okay. Your feet are tiny. Let's make them a bit bigger. Okay. I'm kind of vibing these shoes. Okay, what do we think of this so far? How does she look with wide pants? Let me check out some wide pants. Maybe those ones we put on first that didn't go with the top. Um, that's kind of cute too. Oh, she! I think she looks so much better than before. She seems to have more of like a style now, doesn't she? Those are the wide pants. I also have like the torn pants too, but I think... I think these ones are more of her vibe. You guys are saying try with a crop top crop top something like that one's kind of bit too booby maybe got these kind i like this song this is like a chill song i always feel like i'm in like ibiza with this song like on like a in the daytime on a beach just like watching people go by and maybe having a little cheeky mojito I've also got like the big long buggy jumper. Something like that. Which do you guys prefer? Change the shoes. They are big ones. Look, they've got the big chunky heel. I like the shoes. I think the shoes are really cool. I've got uh, Vans with a big heel like this. Biker shorts under leggings with the uni pack. Ah. That crop top is cute in black. Okay. And I think maybe I'll just give her... She kind of looks cute with that underneath. Look look how many... Oh, is it this one? I've got one of these that has so many K-pop bands on it. <laughs> I don't even know half of them. But it's not that one. Um, I need a belt. Do these belts go with these jeans? Oh, they're a bit too low. Oh, that's really high. Maybe we can give her this round of waist instead. Oh, it won't go with the jeans. Fine! You're not making this easy for me, are you? 
Why won't it put the rings on it either? It's been so rude, guys. It won't put the nails on it. I'm having this issue. None of my nail nail polishes work anymore. I don't know what it is that's caused them to not work, but they don't work anymore. Which is really annoying. Amy loves Claire. Just wanted to let you know with my entire heart that you genuinely saved my life. Honestly, thank you so, so much for everything. Oh, Amy. Thank you for sending that message. I hope you're doing well now. I hope you're doing better. Uh, you guys like the stri- There's a belt in hats. You guys like the striped jacket. I liked the striped jacket. But some other of you guys hated it. Which would be easier to dance in, I guess. Uh, where's that belt up? Um... Jeez, I cannot see today, can I? Oh, the belt's too high, guys. I don't know what it's meant to go with, but yeah, it's a little bit too high. I like her style so much. Maybe we just, I prefer the striped jacket. Okay, I'm gonna do another poll. Top, striped jacket or crop top. One minute, go, go, go. No matter what you decide to do, Claire, I'll be proud. Remember, this is your own personal growth and you do this at your own pace. Not everything will go smoothly, but that's just part of the journey and that's what it must take. Love you so much. That's Claire's noodle. That's about my hair. Thank you so, so much. Okay, there's a poll going on right now. I'm going to vote in it too. Uh, I think striped jacket's definitely winning. Okay, let me go ahead and just show you guys striped jacket again. I really like that striped jacket. Oh, I've got like... That's not really her style, is it? Whoa. Wow, look at that. That makes- that looks so huge on her. It's kind of cute though, right? Okay, where's that striped jacket gone? The jacket isn't her vibe. I kind of feel like it is though. It kind of looks thrifted to me. And she has that kind of vibe about her. That's what she had on before. Um... Here it is. That's the striped jacket. I just, I feel like she's got a really cool, relaxed vibe. I can, she looks like she might go to like, like drama club or something. I don't know, like art school. I don't know. She's got like a cool vibe to her. What do you guys think? She's got thrifted streetwear. <laughs> it's because on the... So I follow like a streetwear subreddit on YouTube. And for the guy stuff, it tends to be like really expensive. Like they've queued outside like a special release and paid like a thousand pounds for like a pair of like trousers or like a couple of tops. But for girls streetwear, it seems to me, me like it's more based around like cool thrifted items or like one expensive piece and the rest of it's thrifted. I don't know, I feel like Girl Street wears a little bit different. So, I don't know. You're saying a different color for the jacket. I don't know, I kind of like that. I don't know. I feel like she's kind of tough. You guys did vote for this though, so it wouldn't feel right to change this now. You couldn't really dance in those jeans. True. I've got like... Like this kind of thing too. Kind of messes with her shoes a little bit. I kind of like those. I know they're a bit out there. But I actually really like those. But they obviously don't go with the top. Those ones do though. Let's change your shoes. Yes, love those bottoms. Different shoes. Okay. Uh, I've got like these like really chunky shoes here. They're massive though. They make her feet look hilarious. What about some Balenciagas? Okay, she could definitely dance in Balenciagas. Aussie Romantic has gifted five more. What? Aussie Romantic, thank you so, so much. Thank you so much. Welcome new people to the Peach Squad. Change the color of the shoes. You can't. Balenciaga's come in black and that's it. But black and that's it. Thank you so much, Ozzy. Also, Nanho! Nanho's gifted five- Ten subs! Ten 
chicken subs. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Thank you so, so much. What? You guys, thank you. Thank you so, so much. Purple is also subscribed. Welcome to the Peach Squad. So is Bixby Lover. Thank you so, so much. Welcome to the Peach Squad. Dan D says, I really hope you didn't mind me asking about your hair. Class, class, stay strong. I think you are brave to open this it and be proud of yourself. And Ozzy Romantic says she needs something easy to dance with. Uh, hopefully this this kind of feels like a, this fandom is the sweetest thing ever. I, it's not my personal style. I, th I think I might have to change the top again, guys. But I do feel like this looks easier to dance in. I don't know now. Ugh. This is really tough. I don't know what to go for. Hollywood style is gifted as well. Thank you so, so much. Um, swear the last uh, the last of the gifted subs for now. Ozzy, please don't feel like you have to, but always thank you so, so much. Also, purple, um, purple555861, welcome to the Peach Squad. And Hannah, Hannah has gifted a bunch more too. Oh my God, this, is there a hype train? Like you guys, what? You guys are so amazing. Thank you so, so much. Thank you so, so much. Oh my gosh, thank you. I feel emotional. I've got, I'm like looking at the camera and the ring light looks blurry because I've got tears in my eyes. You guys are so amazing. Like, so amazing. Which one of these do you, by the way? The white top with the black sleeves. Oh, guys. Honestly, you guys have been so amazing today. Especially how to start having that week where I saw that horrible incident outside and... You guys have been so nice. Which do you guys think? Ah, oh, five emotes shared because of Aussie Romantic. That's so cool. Maybe I'm gonna do indie. Is gonna have uh, Meowbox is giving five tier one subs as well. Oh my gosh, guys! Guys, thank you so so much. Thank you so so much. Her feet now do look huge. They do. Let's shrink them back down. It's because I made them bigger for the other shoes. Um. What was I gonna say? I totally lost track of my brain. My brain is all over the place today. But that top with the manji, the red one. I kind of like the sleeves though. I think that's kind of cool. You know what? Why don't we leave it? Guys, stop this! This is so sweet. L, 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 L who is alone, Grems, and has gifted five subs as well. Thank you so so much. Thank you so much. Honestly, you guys are so amazing. So amazing. Thank you so, so much. Aussie's gifted 36 of you guys with a subscription this week. Literally, Aussie and L, who's alone grams in, and Hannah are like just propping up this community with their amazing, amazing support. Thank you so, so much. Okay, I can't add nail polish to her because it won't let me. I'm gonna leave her for now because I kind of want to see how you compare and contrast the two of them next to each other so let's just remind ourselves of all of the cc that we've got um so we are going to be using on violet where's the skin details okay is this overlay in number one? Oh my gosh is it just me or does she look so much better like literally this is her now shall i make her dance there she goes zoom is okay and this is her before. Like, she kind of looks a bit alien in now before when I look at her. I still love her. She's still a little banger. However, new, this is what she deserved. This is what Indy deserved the whole time. Like, wow. Wow, wow, wow. I wonder if I've got a hairline I can put on her. Because her hairline's kind of tragic, let's face it. Are you guys doing more subs? What? Nan Hall has gifted 10 subs! 10 subs! What? And Hannah has gifted 5 subs as well! You guys! Honestly, you guys are so amazing! What? You guys are so awesome! Thank you so, so much! And I'm really grateful, I'm so grateful! And I hope that you guys in the chat are giving them some love. And also all of you guys that have been that are now subscribers. Thank you so generosity. Please make sure you give them some love as well. Okay, if I gave her a hairline, it would take off her blush. However, from the side, it would just look so much better. Even that look like that looks a lot better, doesn't it? So it's that. 
that. I think she looks fine without the blush. I think it matches her style more, and now she has a better hairline. Okay, India's done. I'm gonna move on to Violet. Uh, Smee Squirrel says this morning's stream has been awesome. I just watched an ad and got some bits for you. Oh, I didn't know you could do that. Oh, wow, that's so cool. Sorry, I'm so Twitch ignorant. Honestly, I really am. I'm so Twitch ignorant. Okay, you can see, I think you can see straight away that Violet does have a slightly different face to Indy. She naturally has a more prominent chin. So, just for continuation purposes, I'm gonna go ahead and just give her a bit of a more prominent chin so that she kind of matches up with Indy a little bit more. Okay. And then, should I go for different brows? Those were Indy's brows, but I kind of feel like a Violet would wear her slightly differently. Maybe a little bit more arched. So I think that is what I'm going to do. Um, finding the right ones, though, because they've got a bit of a... What I might have to do is find some brows I like. And then I'll just change her brow bone a little bit. Because it's quite hard to get brows that, like, much their shape, their face shape very well. Hmm. Maybe I should leave them a bit flatter, actually. Yeah, maybe they looked okay. Then just do them a bit further apart. Okay, I'll keep those for now, but let's go ahead. I'll do her eyes first, and then we'll put on the same skin details. Aussie Romantic. Indie looks like Abby from The Last of Us 2. She does, you know. I I don't know why I didn't try that hair out on Abby, actually. I love Abby in The Last of Us. Like, it really makes me angry when I see, like, the fact that she got... Like, there was a lot of negativity around her appearance. It just proves to me, like... There's this thing where I see people being like, Oh, it's so unrealistic to put women as, as main characters in video games because they're not strong enough. Like, look at them, their bodies aren't strong enough, so it's unrealistic for Lara Croft to do everything she does. And yet, then, when they add, like, a character that actually is buff and strong and looks like they can definitely go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the guy characters and climb all the stuff and hang by one arm, people are like, oh, well, yeah, but the muscle's ugly. And it's like, well, what do you want? You, you want, you either want an unreal, you need to be happy with an unrealistic body doing stuff that is not realistic, or you need to be happy with a muscular body doing stuff that's muscular. Like, make up your minds. And this seems to be like a really thing that sticks with me. Like it really bugs me. Oh my gosh! Aussie Romantic has gifted 10! 10. 10 tier 1 subs to this community! Aussie, you said, you said no more! Oh my gosh, and Nanho! Nanho has gifted 10 as well! You guys, honestly! Please, massive, massive love in the chat for these guys. I don't know if you're like having a race together or what, but that is crazy. Aussie Romantic 46? Ah, what? This community is so amazing. Oh, you guys. You guys are so amazing. Thank you so, so much. This has been like the most hypey stream for subs that I think I've ever had, ever. So thank you so, so much. So, so much. That's amazing. Everyone, you can get a free sub a month if you connect your Amazon Prime account to Twitch. Yes, you can. You can do that. My mum did that to me the other day. She's like, Claire, I just wanted to let you know I'm subscribed to you now on, on, um, on Twitch because I linked my Amazon account. I'm like, oh, mum, you're so cute. So cute. Thank you, mum. I kind of feel like even though we went for blonde eyelashes on Indy, I kind of want to go for black eyelashes on um, Violet. Like, she's put quite a lot of black mascara on just because I feel like they've got a different vibe to each other. Nanhol and Ozzy are so kind. They are so kind. Yay, I've given her the big eyelashes. Make her chin smaller. Okay, there we go. She's got the very V-shaped face, which again, I think suits her too. Uh, I said I was gonna give her slightly different freckles to her sister. So I'll give her the same hairline though, which is this one. But obviously hers is gonna be lighter. Maybe here, the blonde hair. Um, and then let's pop some. I was thinking for her freckles, it would be less freckles and more just like Maybe like, you know, like random mole kind of things. Like I've got, just like a few, just like that, just to give her a bit of interest. Adigan! Adigan is gifted subs too! 
Wes! Oh my gosh, you guys! So gifty today! This is the most generous, generous stream ever. This is amazing. Owie has just subscribed using Prime as well. Charlie has uh, has also used 100 bits to say, Claire, you never seem to see my messages, but I hope you're having a good day. I've been watching you since last summer while I was pregnant. I know your videos are the only thing that my baby stops crying for. Oh my gosh, I love that. That's so cute. And Carly Juan 97 has subscribed as well. Thank you so, so much. Wow. The Peach Quads community is strong. The Peach Quads community is getting strong. Teffel just subscribed using their Twitch Prime as well. That's so cool. That is so cool. So many peaches in the chat right now. That's awesome. Okay, so I'm gonna give her these ones right here. And then I'm gonna honestly stick to a lot of the same skin details as her sister has because I want them to keep looking like twins. Although I might go a little bit wider in her mouth. Just like little stuff that separates them. But I think I'm gonna go for similar-ish nose. Actually, I think I'm going to go for that nose rather than that one. Again, just so they've got l little things that are slightly different that could be just the, you know, they do their makeup differently or whatever. <gasps> oh, did I just take off her eyes? Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Your eyes can go back on, babes. There you go. Okay, and we said that she would go for more class- What?! Nan Hall has gifted five tier subs! Nan Hall! That is- <laughs> Are you guys arranging this in like DMs or something? Like, what are you guys doing? This is so nice. Claire, could you wish me a belated happy birthday? Nanho, when was your birthday? I hope you had an amazing birthday, honestly. Happy, happy birthday. Drama Llama, 2121, Drama Llamas. <laughs> Welcome to the Peach Squad. And Emma says, uh, you've really helped me feel better about myself. I'm glad, I'm glad, I'm glad, I'm glad. Always love to hear if I'm making you guys feel good. Um, that makes me really, really happy to hear, so... That is what I'm here for. Like I said, it's on my, it's literally there on my, um, oh wow, that guy that puts quite big bags under her eyes, doesn't it? It's always there on my Twitter to say, I'm here to make you guys smile. And that is fully what my channel is about. Uh, Grace Ellen says, Claire, we're so proud of you. You make us so happy. You always put a smile on my face. You're so amazing. You put so much hard work and dedication into your videos to make us smile. I've made you, you've made such an amazing community that has become my home. I'm forever grateful for all the friends I've made here. We love and support you so much. Oh, thank you so, so much. And uh, Sim Spacey says, happy non-binary awareness week to Alonzo. Yes. And Candice has subscribed as well. Welcome to the Peach Squad. Oh, wow. Just general really, really happy Wednesday vibes today. Really happy Wednesday vibes. I love that. I was so worried about today's stream after having to delay it. Um, and instead, it's just been... It's just gone really amazingly, so I kind of love that. I'm just going to keep these ones on her for now while I try out a flick on her. Yeah, because I was kind of thinking... Wait, let me just take that off completely. I think like a nice flick. I need to find... Oh, wow. Those are very lashy lashes, aren't they? I kind of like the underneath lashes for her, though. Okay. And then I'm going to have to put a flick on top instead. Um... Asheron has just subscribed as well. Hannah! Hannah has now just gifted 10 pi- 10, 10? What? What? Nano, what? Hannah has just gifted 10 more peach, tier one peach scrub. To peach, oh my gosh, I can't even get my words out. I'm so flustered. Asheron, welcome to the peach squad. And Hannah, thank you so much. What? I feel like the whole of the, the chat, more or less, is now a member of the Peach Squad, which is so amazing. Thanks to those guys' it's just generosity. Honestly, thank you guys so much. This is so cool. We're all like, all of the, the Peach gang just like vibing out together. Love that. Love that. Okay. Ugh. Eye flicks and pink and red lips. Yeah, I think red lips for sure. Oh, this is so cool. Ah, oh, Aphrodite is just subscribed. Welcome to the Peach Squad. Can you tell I'm like very flustered right now? Because I feel very flustered right now. Overwhelmed. I feel overwhelmed. In a good way though, don't worry. Um, I'm trying to look for some like red lips for her. She's looking cute. I kind of like this gloss on her though. Like some little, little glossiness looks cute. I can imagine her putting a lip gloss on before she films a video. <laughs> you should have done Joseph too. He was kind of tragic. He did get like a late in life kind of makeover though. 
uh, for my story. <laughs> but yeah, he was kind of tragic. I've got a lot better at Sims, I think. I've been doing an alphabet le legacy challenge. Since uh, since it was Pride, I did it for every gen that had a gender identity or sexuality that matched the letter. It was a great eye-opening experience and helped me educate myself about different people's identities. That's Rubicon. That's a really cool idea. I love that. Um, also, th we're, we're very thankful to those that are gifting, but please don't, like, try and, like, guilt people or, like, get, like, salty about not getting a gift when, when people are gifting them. Like, we, do, we need to be thankful for when people are doing this, but we shouldn't make them feel like they have to do it, you know? Please don't, please don't beg because it's not, it's really not fair on, on putting that pressure on people that are just being really generous, okay? Matt, the Pug Cat was gifted. Matt, thank you so, so much. Welcome to the Peach Squad, to our new subscriber. This is making you guys remember how attractive Caden is. Oh, we've got Caden to do still, don't we? Caden is like the birth of a lot of attractive sims because he was used as a basis for people like Fran. So a lot of our future attractive sims came from Caden's DNA. I'm kind of thinking she suits pink more than red. Like, I think that looks kind of cute. Just my two cents. I think she's more of a, pe a pink lips kind of girl. What do you guys think? I like that one on her. Although she's kind of also rocking that. Pink or red? What do you guys think? Not whole is gifted more subs. Ten more subs. What? Your generosity is insane. Yes, it is. It is actually insane. Amy Marie is gifted as well. Thank you so, so much. And be, uh, be nice. Be nice is gift, uh, as uh, subscribed to you. Amy and be nice have subscribed. Nan Hall, this is crazy. I think we've got over 100 subs just from the top three alone. Yeah, we have. Guys, that's so mad. That is so mad. I'm going to ask. I'm going to do a poll for pink or red. Pink. Or red. I think pink, but let's see what you guys think. And I'm just gonna get some cheeks on her while we're deciding. Hannah! Hi oh my gosh! You guys, Hannah's gifted five more peach t one peach subs. You guys are actually just blowing my minds right now. Like what? My 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 face is so red. Like my face is so red. This is so crazy. This is so crazy. I cannot see the polls. Um, the poll is up there. Oh, wow. It's 86% pink. Okay, I'm going to just immediately put her back in pink because you guys seem to really like that one. It was this one, wasn't it? Was it this? Wait, that one is really good on her skin tone. I've actually got the mark on there and I don't hate it. What has become of me? I do not know. Oh, wow. The, the mark one kind of... That's contouring her face really nicely. This is the other Mac one. I don't usually, I've never used the Mac stuff before. Hmm. Uh, sorry, I'm just trying on a bunch of different stuff to get like a vibe for what looks good on her. She needs, I need to put her hair on. She ne definitely needs her hair on. I kind of think maybe we just go for some contouring on her instead. But which one? This one or the MAC one? That's the first time I've not hated the MAC stuff. I think that looks pretty good. It's like contouring her cheeks and nose. I think that looks pretty nice. Okay, pink. We definitely went for pink. Amira contributed channel points and so did Sly Fox as well. J. Ellen! J. Ellen has gifted five subs to the community too. And Hannah, uh, Hannah Manin Manini. Hannah Manini has just subscribed as well. And so has It's Your Boy Ro Roman. It's Your Boy Roman has just subscribed. And Carly has just gifted a sub as well. That's so cool. Okay, let's go ahead and pop. Should I pop that hair on her that I said would suit her a lot? Like, I just feel like this is kind of like... That hair is a whole vibe on her. I might lighten her brows a little bit because she's quite fair, isn't she? Maybe a little darker than that. Maybe like here. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Carly, welcome to the peach. Oh no, Carly's gifted. Carly, Carly's gifted. Thank you so much. Y'all are way too generous. They look so much like Emily. They really do. 
But I think they look different to each other, which I think is good. Her hair is actually more yellow than this. I don't know why. That's Emily's hair color, isn't it? Whereas hers is more yellow. So let me go to, for a bit more of a yellow color. More like that. I think I can change the color of those clips potentially. Yeah, more like that. Hers is more yellowy blonde. Okay. She's looking pretty cute so far. I'm going to do some drop earrings on her. Just like some pretty drop ones. Um, although, should she have her hair tied up if she's doing yogis? Maybe. She also needs her necklace back on, doesn't she? Um, have we got any like pretty kind of cute ones? No, that's a bit too edgy. That's too edgy. I feel like she's more like classical beauty. She's a bit more like a mum. They started off quite similar, but then they ended up a little bit different to each other, which is fine. It's, it's kind of cute. Yeah, something like that is more her style. There. Okay. Indy kind of looks like Emma. She does. That is how they remind me, actually. Oh, my coffee's so cold. Hannah Manini has gifted a sub and Easy Breezy says, Hi Clem, so happy you're doing a stream. Feeling a little ill um, from changing my mental health medication. Almost didn't get out of bed this morning to work, but you've uh, distracted me and given me motivation to push through how I'm feeling. Love you. That's by Ease Breezy. I know exactly how you feel on those days where you don't want to get out of bed. And I also know how horrible it can be switching your medication, mental health medication. So I really, really am glad that I was managing to help motivate you today because I know it can be difficult. Um, and sending love your way. Aussie Romantic has gifted 10 subs to the community. Let's honestly, Aussie, 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 Aussie. You're so nice, but please, no more now. Okay, no more. Look at, like, I, I said you were taking time off. Please, please get a gift for yourself. Do something nice for yourself, okay? Please do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. Thank you so, so much. 56 subs is insane. And Super Geek as well, welcome to the Peach Squad. Honestly, Aussie Romantic, please give some love to her in the chat because it just, um, wow. Wow, 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 wow. Oh, this is like a really emotional, beautiful stream today. Thank you guys for making it that way. Honestly. And Hannah, Hannah Elizabeth has gifted five subs as well. Thank you so much to our super, super generous peaches in the chat today. You guys are so amazing. Massive, massive love for you guys. But please now, please go and go open up a different tub. Go to some, like, go to ASOS or something and just get yourself something nice. Please, please treat yourselves. Nan Hall has gifted subs as well. Nan Hall, tub. ASOS or anywhere ASOS just came into my head first please just get yourself something nice look after yourselves treat yourselves because you totally deserve it honestly sorry I want to see what that coat looked like you guys are so amazing thank you so so much okay <laughs> um how did you copy paste the sim thing to go you never said anything more about it what do you mean by is that the using mcc because you can use mcc to copy and paste over skin details yui992 welcome to the peach squad aussie romantic said oh my gosh my bank just asked me about buying it was like the activities are weird oh my gosh even your bank says look after yourself aussie even your bank is saying it <laughs> okay i'm gonna go for athleisure for violet athleisure wear which is kind of like you would wear, you can wear it around and about town, but you can go into a workout whenever you want as well, which I think kind of suits her entire vibe. These, I'm kind of thinking bottoms instead of shorts, but I have a matching top to that that I think will really work with this look. Um, and we need like yogi bear pants or like, you know, something. I don't know if that's, no, I kind of feel like a little bit more sh chic almost. Um... Blitz has just subscribed as well. Welcome to the Peach Squad. Violet is low-key quite buff. Now she's pretty low, like that would be buff. Um, but she's actually, they're both, they're both tiny. That is all through Emily. Emily just got like the tiny jean and just passed it on to everyone. I do have some Nike, like sweatpants things, like yoga pants. Let me try and find them. 
They're not particularly new, but they kind of go best for what we're trying to do right now. Um, where are they at? Got these as well. They kind of work too. Uh, Peaches is broken. You can check points at the end as always. Crazy Ella has just described. Oh no, Crazy Ella's one of this. We're still catching up with all the giftings. We're still catching up with all the giftings. Okay, these. So I'm thinking we go for, we could go for Violet actually. She's so cute, look at her face. And then where is that Tommy Hilfiger just gone? Tommy Hilfiger, where you at? Where you at? Oh, we don't have to go that. We have got some other ones as well. Got stuff like this, like this. A little bit of Balenciaga. Pretty cool. I like saying that word because I said it wrong for so long that I now I'm like, yay, Balenciaga, I can actually say it. I was I was like saying Balenciaga or something. I'm, just, I'm such an idiot, man. I just can't say words. I just can't say them. Look, she's all ready for pajama stream. Um, 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 where is that top gone? Bella Lily has just gifted us a Bella Lily, thank you. Uh, there we go. Okay, I just kind of feel like this is like a whole vibe. That's too Michi Machi, that's too clashy. Okay, pink or gray? Both of them are kind of cute. I'm kind of thinking pink. What do you guys think? I think that's cute. Violet is my favorite sim ever. Summer, just wanted to say hi. Hey, Summer. Yes to a PJ stream. Pink or gray, guys? Mm -mm -mm. Have you got the new mom boyfriend jeans? What, for, for me? Oh, I've got my boyfriend jeans on. What do you mean for Violet? Pink or gray? Oh my gosh, we're gonna do a poll. This is pretty close. I can't tell. Uh, I can't tell just from the chat alone, so I'm gonna do it as a poll. Top color, pink or gray? Go, go, go. You have one minute to decide. <laughs> I think this one's gonna be close. I think this could be our closest one yet. I'll just show you the gray as well so you can, your eyes know which one's which. Gray, pink, gray, pink, gray, pink. What do you guys think? Gray's winning so far. Gray is 64%. Oh. Claire, she already wore that top. Has she already got this in an outfit? No, she had this before. Yeah, maybe she had it later in life, but I don't know, it kind of, it's kind of vibe into it. Gray, okay, let's go gray. She already wore those pants before, but I don't actually have any other workout pants. So I need to get some more CC. Oh my gosh, she co totally couldn't work out in that, but can we just talk about how cute she looks wearing them? Like, look at that. Look at that. They look so amazing on her. However, I really would not advise using those whilst you're doing yoga. That seems like a great... Oh, look, they're Elsa shoes. That seems like a great way to end up injuring yourself. She's had those pants on top. Uh, I, it's tough, though, because I've not downloaded any new athleisure wear. What am I supposed to do? Are those glowing shoes? Oh, what? I can definitely see her wearing those. You see with the little petals on them? They're cute. They're cute. Okay, I like her shoes. Oh, yeah, sorry. The grey one, didn't it? I need to change this hot colour. There we go. I mean, I don't have any other... Unless I literally went full Tommy with her, I don't have any other athleisure pumps. So I wouldn't have anything else to give her. This is very 80s, isn't it? The uni leggings are really nice. Let me check out the uni leggings. Could give her those ones. Keep them violet, because she's violet. 
Those are kind of cute. Would you rather go for these ones? You guys like the full Tommy Hill figure. Yoga in heels. I'm vibing to this music, man. Okay, final poll, then we move on to Kaden. Let's go, go, go. Clay, you're making me hungry. I'm sorry. The one at the bottom. Ooh. Ooh, they're cool. Ooh, I like those. Ooh, they are a whole vibe. If they can make CC like this, then how would you explain the denim short skirt? Skirt with bottoms, like how? How? What are you eating, Claire? I'm still eating my noodles. They're very cold. I like these ones. Are these ones as well? Oh yeah. Oh man, those are cute as well. I don't. I... Uni trousers of one. Okay. Which ones, guys? These ones, these ones, or these ones? I kind of like these ones. I didn't realize the uni pack had such cool stuff in it because I never check. I never check their actual stuff, <laughs> which is kind of bad, isn't it? It is kind of bad. I like these ones, the bottom ones. Okay, let's go for these ones. Okay, and the shoes are super cute. Violet is done, so here was OG Violet. I mean, she's still very iconic, but here is how she looked originally. And then here is new CC Violet, updated. She's so pretty, like she's literally so pretty. With a new look and uh, a new, kind of a new face almost. And here is how she looks in comparison to... I, I, I kind of... I'm a bit more of an indie stan personally. However, they do both look great. They both do look like twins, but they also look different enough to be their own people, which I think is really cool. So... Oh, what's Ali doing outside? Hi! Let me know which one you prefer and let me know if you like their updated looks in the... Uh, she looks like Charlie D'Amelio. I can see that. Um... Violet looks like Regina. Okay, we're gonna finish off with a bit of Caden. Caden, I'm excited for. And it's our first guy that we've done today as well. So I'm also really excited for that. This is Caden's base and... This is Caden's bod. Like, we were all, you guys were, oh, not, not all of you guys. A lot of you guys did appreciate the Caden, but other people were like, why is Faith going for Caden? Like he's older, he's a bit of a fuddy duddy. He's already gone gray. Faith knew! Faith knew! Faith totally knew! Challenge Simmer, welcome to the Peach Squad! Aussie Romantic, I really want a Sims pack to make a pack with werewolves! I'm over making werewolves that are not really werewolves. I don't understand why we don't have werewolves, because we had them in Sims... We have them in Sims 3? I think we definitely had them in 2. If you put enough trees in your garden, you'd get wolves, and then if you made friends with a wolf, I think they could bite you and you'd turn into a werewolf. I seem to remember that. Uh, yeah, Caden is ridiculously ripped. Ridiculously ripped. Like, ridiculously ripped. Okay. So, I'm gonna have to open this window because I'm really warm. Darcy's lying on my window. I wish I could. Do you want to see Darcy for a quick sec? Let's say hi to Darcy. Let me grab him. Look, it's the baby. Hey, Bubba. Darcy likes being stroked like this. It looks like I'm squishing his head, but he likes it. Ali discovered that. I'll say hi to the camera. Look how baby you are. Oh, you're so soft and gentle. Mwah. Gentle giant, aren't you? Okay. It's Darcy. Go say hi to Ali. Come on. <laughs> <sighs> I've got a lot of cat hair in my mouth right now. Um, 
when I open my window, Darcy jumps out of it. So he's jumped out the window to go see Ali now. <laughs> Uh, Aussie Romantic says, My god fans myself, he is gorgeous. Also, some guys go grey in their 20s. My brother has already got a lot of greys in his side. And I'm like, you need to grow the whole hair grey, because I think grey hair is so cool. It's like, more unusual and interesting. Ali's mum's hair is like, full grey. But it's that really nice kind of grey, and it's all the same colour. It just looks so cool. My mum wants to go grey. <laughs> She's like, I don't want the old grey hair, I just want to go fully grey. I think it's a whole vibe. Oh, sorry, I've got so much cat hair on my face now. Honestly, this is our life. It's just a life of cat hair. All the time. Okay, let's go ahead and change out his eyes. I might keep them on the same eye set, because uh, I think if you're doing that with... What am I doing? Yeah. Uh, it just kind of looks neater, almost. So... I want him to have very grey eyes, though. They're a bit too blue. That's probably grey, isn't it? Oh, and I feel like they need to pop a bit more. Really great. Like that. His Scalera, though, is way too light. So, let me just go on to... Caden's so ripped. Like, he's got to be one of our... He's, like, up there with... Um... Surprisingly enough, he's up there with, like... Sim Ali and Connor and James. But you just wouldn't expect it of him. That's why it's kind of confusing. My mum hates grey hair, so she dyes it. That's the thing, if you if you get the odd grey hair, it's annoying. But if you get fully grey hair, then I think just just go with it. And you can like you can dye colours, I think, on grey hair. Like certain colours on grey hair look really cool. Oh wow. We're going well 80s now. I don't know why, but we are. Fully 80s. Claire, you're scared of getting old, but you love grey hair. I had grey hair for a while. I'm actually thinking of getting this wig, but in um, grey. So. Uh, I, I really like the look of grey hair. Because I think you can still look young and have grey hair. Sorry, his eyes are just way too light. So I've just lightened, I've just made him go down a bit. Because I don't, I don't like it when the Scalera doesn't have enough shadow on it. Yeah, that, that looks so much better. This is literally just me being a perfectionist, I know. Uh, but it's just one of those things that really bugs me. So there we go. And then the other thing I always do with these eyes, because it's got that stupid line at the bottom, is I go into piercings and I put a highlight here. Because I just feel like it kind of reduces the impact of that. You can't notice that line at the bottom bit. It is just me being really uh, pedantic, but it's the way I roll. Can you do their heights? What? What? How did you imagine these guys as heights? I'm kind of interested to know. Oh, I can't stop vibing. Yeah, my mum's like, oh, I've not been able to get my hair done since lockdown. Like, my hair's so grey. And yeah, I look at her hair and I'm like, I can't see any greys. My mum's same hair colour as me. It's like fair brown. Um, and I don't think you get greys as much if you have fair brown hair. Whereas, like, I feel like darker hair gets more greys. That's my personal view. I've had greys, mainly on the sides though. I don't have, like, noticeable greys yet. Um, it's the one thing I actually want from age and I don't have it. Indy would be shorter than Violet. I, I kind of feel like the twins would be the same height. Caden should be tall. They should all be really tall. Okay, because Emily must have been tall if she was a supermodel, right? Um, wow, those are some bushy brows. You know what, though? I don't hate them. I don't hate them. Just thin them a little bit like that. Okay, just pop some skin details on. Let's get... Let's get him moving. Caden would be tall. Yeah, because Faith would be tall from Emily. And I kind of feel like Taylor... Taylor's probably kind of tall too. So yeah, I kind of... I will do. I'll add their heights at the end. Okay, I knew the skin was going to look good on him. I think that looks real nice. It's taken away some of his buffness. But I mean, I can add that back on. Um, where is it? There. There we go. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. You will be fed on this channel. <laughs> and then... 
I kind of don't want to go too intense on his lashes. Yeah, just something like that, I think. Maybe even not, maybe not even that much. Oh, now we've gone from like eights is vibing to like. It's pretty though. Winzy Sims, welcome to the Peach Squad. Bianca B, hello. Dean Calorie. What? Dean. Dean Calorie has just subscribed. Is that actually Dane? Dane, are you pretending you're called Dean? Dean Calorie, welcome to the Peach Squad. Simmer Elise, welcome to the Peach Squad. Uh, Ozzy says she gets one white hair in her brow. My mum has one crazy brow hair. I always have to get it for her. And also, I picture tall, um, Caden, I picture tall, but the girl's like 5'8 to 5'10. 5'8 to 5'10, though, is tall for a girl. The average girl in the UK is 5 foot. Is it like 5 foot 4, maybe? 5 foot 5 or 6? Angel Face, welcome to the Peach Squad. Uh, Dalen, hello, sorry for missing your sub last stream. Welcome to the Peach Squad. Um, sorry, I'm trying to put eyelashes on Caden, but I don't want to go too heavy. I'm just vibing to the music hard today. <laughs> okay. Did Caden have freckles? Caden had a whole facial hair thing going on, didn't he? Okay, did Caden ever have children? Did Caden ever have children? He didn't have any freckles either. Did I let these jeans die? Did I let these jeans die? <laughs> what? Uh, Miss Fabel, thank you for gifting a sub. Did I let these jeans die? Oh, he can't have kids. Oh, man. I sure know how to pick the Sims for those storylines, don't I? We lost Summer's jeans as well. These jeans disappeared, I'm afraid. He had this kind of facial hair. But I kind of feel like it's a bit much. Maybe that. Can you try the god skin? Okay. You guys don't know what the god skin is? There's a specific skin detail which tends to be godly on men. It is... I don't know why this song keeps going, yeah. <laughs> uh, where is the god skin? Here. It's the Obscurus N5 overlay. Okay, I'm just gonna have to remove this off it really quickly so you can see it. It looks good. Oh my gosh, which one? God or this one? They both look really good. Let me just put a nose overlay on them irregardless. I kind of am sort of attached to the first one we did though. Okay, which one? They both look really good. But I use this one on everyone. So I kind of feel like we should go for something a bit different. Because otherwise I'm just going to end up with everybody having the same skin. And when I put that on him, he started to look like Asher straight away. And that's the problem with always putting the same skin on everyone. Which is definitely a bad habit I have. It's not my fault, it just looks so good on them. <laughs> Okay. I don't really want to do too much else because I kind of feel like uh, you've mixed Caden. Uh, uh, you mixed Caden and made a boy with him. He was used too. Oh, is that Fran? That might be Fran. Um, yeah, that could be Fran. Let's. I'm wondering if he might look better with a little bit of like texture around his eyes. Because he's meant to be a little bit older than Faith, isn't he? Because he's already like a consultant, I think. So I should make him look slightly older. Just a little bit. Just because he's meant to be a little bit older. Okay. And then... Caden, will you marry me? <laughs> um... Is there anything I can put on here? Some type, some some of the guy sims just suit a bit of guy liner, and I have no issue with guy liner. 
See, this is kind of bringing out his top eyelid a bit more. Which I think is a whole vibe. Let's go a bit darker, though. Right here. Okay. And then... No, that's taken it away. Okay. I don't think we need to do much to him. <laughs> it's like, you know, when you have your cake, the cake I've made is perfect. And I'm trying to like figure a way to inject jam into it. And everyone's like, the cake's fine. Just leave the cake alone. That's kind of where I am right now. Oh, wait a minute. Cheekbones. Oh my gosh. Yes. <sighs> it's getting warm in here. Is it just me? <laughs> why do my streams always end up so thirsty? Like why? I find it sometimes so hard to get the right lip color. This is the boring bitch you don't see when I make Sims in a video. Trying on every single lip that I have in the hopes of finding one that might look right. It sometimes takes me a very long time. But I find like lip, lips are one of those things that it's actually like quite hard to know what a nude lip would look like. And also because everyone's are different. So my lips are naturally very, very pink. But other people's lips are naturally very red or more close to their skin tone. It's one of those things that's really hard to predict. Because that, like, his lips need to be darker and redder. Sunbeam, uh, Sunbeam Bread Fan Club. Welcome to the Fish Squad. Angelic Devil, uh, 2 and 2, has gifted a sub. And it's EXT Space has used their Twitch Prime for a subscription. Thank you guys so, so much. Everything is made out of cake. It is true. Jim Jams. Jimmy Jams. Wait, that's... No, that's a different thing. When I was making the sim with Ali, this is what I was wanting to do, but I knew I'd lose him. Okay, I'm gonna go for those ones. Because it's just... It's just too long. Too long. Okay! Jeez, Caden is smoking already he always was but there's something very more smoky about him right now let's go for hair and then we will add his glasses afterwards is the twitch prime sub free the twitch prime sub you can use if you already have um amazon prime so if you use it for getting next day deliveries or if you use it for the t tv to get all the uh, the extra tv shows using twitch prime then you can also use it for um uh, Twitch as well, because Amazon owned Twitch. Okay, let's find him some hair. I feel like we're covering too much of his beautiful face here. We're full on in Tropical House vibes now. This is like a couple of hours before sunset if you're on holiday somewhere that's kind of got a clubby vibe to it. And you're like chilling around the pool and the sun's starting to set. And everyone's getting into that kind of we're gonna start partying soon mood. This is the kind of music I imagine they play because guess what? I've never done that, but I've seen it on TV shows before. Uh, okay. <laughs> what hair do we do on him? Amazon saved me on this one. It is handy for that. This is, this is, oh, this is the whole vibe. I love this kind of music though. I like like relaxing music. Uh, SLX Classic 28, welcome to the Peach Squad. He's hun he's so freaking handsome. He is so handsome. Who is Caden? Caden is uh, Faith's partner. Did they get married? I think they did. He w he worked in her hospital. He was a doctor in her hospital, uh, and he was almost a kind of a mentor in a way. Uh, he helped her out a lot with meds, like her was deciding what she wanted to go into in medicine. Uh, she. Did he go into surgery and she went into chief of stuff? I think that's the way they did things. Um, I really don't know what hair to put on him. Uh, but they ended up falling in love. What hair do I do, guys? I've tried a quite a lot on him. He actually really suits the Sammy hair. Kind of feels weird putting this hair on anyone but Sammy. But he does suit the Sammy hair. A lot. That's kind of crazy. He suits that a lot. Hello, Cosmic Pop Tart. As you, uh, Cosmic Pop Tart and Jen Crest have both used their Amazon Prime subscription. Thank you so so much. Welcome to the Peach Squad. Also, Sims Lucky 18x. Welcome to the Peach Squad as well. Do you guys like this hair? I I kind of like the hair on him. You like the messy one? Okay. Again, we'll do another poll. 
Caden hair. I'm going to show you the messy one for comparison. Messy hair or old Sammy hair? Because don't forget, Sammy has new hair now. <laughs> okay, I'll start the poll and then let's find the messy one to do a little compare and contrast. Oh, this is the messy one. So it's this or... This. Here. There we go. This or this. He looks great with both. Like, we're not really losing here, are we? We're not really losing here, are we? Shona has subscribed and it's Jenny Scott of both subscribed using their Twitch Prime as well. Welcome to the Peach Squad. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Where is the poll? It should be appearing at the top. Like, a lot of you guys can see it. You guys are saying messy hair. Okay. Oh, wait. That's not, that ain't right. This is Kane's hair. Kind of two opposites having the same hair. I like that. Did Caden have a nose ring? I seem to remember him having a nose ring. Uh, why are his eyelashes doing that with his glasses? I might have to do glasses without any fra any glass. Yeah, like that. Just so that his eyes don't get messed up. Glasses option number one. They're really tiny in his face, they're not gonna work. Got these ones too. They're also very small. Okay, messy hair won the poll. Hopri, hope present, hope, hope Esperanza, nineteen ninety eight, subscribe using their Twitch Prime. Welcome to the Peach Squad. Shona seven two eight, and it's Jenny Scott. Oh, I called you guys up. Welcome to the Peach Squad, and Delilah Sims four. Welcome to the Peach Squad as well. Okay, this man is a whole vibe. Never seen those lashes before. They must be new. I've got these ones here as well. Okay, glasses, 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 glasses. These were his original glasses. But I'm kind of thinking these. I think they suit him more. Like, with the dark frame. Okay. Wow, 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 wow. Hey, Clyde, just want to say a huge thank you. Uh, you've helped me with many others so much. You're creating an amazing community. I'm so happy to be a part of it. After your last stream, we raided Rochella and seeing her cry happy tears was honestly one of the best things. Your community is amazing. You should be extremely proud of what you've created. Peachy love from Luke. Thank you so, so much, Luke. Um, what time are you streaming on Friday? I don't think I've got anything booked in currently for Friday. Maybe I do, actually. No, I do. It's, I'll leave it as 12 for now. If I have to change it, please check on my Twitter because that's where I change things. Uh, Miranda has also unlocked some emotes for you guys. And Chloe, hello, Chloe. Um, I'm going to have to redo Caden in my game now. Okay. Sun mode off. Yeah, because it's messing with his eyelashes. I know it looks very much... Maybe he just keeps them very clean. Maybe he's meticulous about his glasses. Uh, and he's a doctor. So instantly, like, this is what he wore before. It was kind of like a... A jumper and it is so basic is actually kind of low-key a bit boring Wait, his eyebrows are darker than his hair oh they are here as well I, he, his entire look is meant to be around the fact that you would never know what was like the the level of top tierness that was hiding behind this cardigan that is the whole of Caden's vibe like Underneath the cardigan, there is like a full on 10 out of 10, but you just don't know that. So the frumpy cardigan, I think is kind of important to his look. I kind of like the black shirt underneath it. Um, have you got a game for another after dark stream? No, our final episode of Until Dawn, Ali's gonna join me for it, it's gonna be on Thursday. And then after that, we need a new after dark stream. It doesn't have to be a violent game or a sweary game. It's just a game that, um, I don't know, it could be anything, but just something that's not Sims, you know, that kind of vibe. Basically, it doesn't matter what the rating of the game is, like, I will play it. Okay, he has to look like a GP. He has to look like a consultant, sorry. So a GP is someone you come and see, like, if you've got a problem with your nose, or, like, a problem with your hearing, or anything, or a part problem, and they will refer you to a specialist, that specialist will be a consultant, like Caden, and Caden will be really... He, his specialism was surgery though, which actually could be a cardiologist 
We're gonna go for a cardiologist. He's a cardiologist. Uh, I want some more slim fitting. I want some really like slim fit trousers. I've got loads of tra oh my gosh just whipping out the Gucci you know what why not he's earning good money so if he wants to if he wants to splash out on a bit of Gucci more power to him I kind of like the dark blue uh, and then let's pop some little shoes on him Jay you're fresh welcome to the peach squad uh, and Beth 252509 and also Arctic Ocean Eyes all of them have used their uh, Amazon Prime thank you guys so much for joining the peach squad Miranda, hello, and Chloe, hello as well. Uh, welcome to Peach Squad. I wanted to do Fat Fran and Phoenix, uh, but I mean, kind of regretting that now because we've got this whole man. I'd forgotten just how good Kanan was. Like, honestly, I was like, which character would I raise from the dead? He would never actually pop into my mind, but now I'm realizing what an error that is. Okay, I kind of feel like he'd go for like, his look, like, if you don't know, it, you, he'd, like, you'd look and just think, okay, he's just dressed nicely. But then if you actually look, you're like, wait a minute, he's got the Gucci belt on. Those shoes are like, are like there's the tailored trousers. Like, that's a really expensive, thick knit cardigan. And those shoes are like, actually like this year designer shoes and all that kind of thing. Like, you're like, oh, my man's actually got it, you know? That is what his, his look is meant to be. Should we go a bit fun with the pink laces? I think those though, because they, they bring out his belt. And they go, like, dark blue and brown go together really well, and his trousers are dark blue. He's very Clark Kent! He is! Okay, so. Uh, Jay Bourne, welcome to the Peach Squad. Uh, Aussie Romantic said the newer Tomb Raider games would be fun. Uh, they would, actually. I played a little bit of that, didn't I? Um, okay, so. This was OG Caden. I mean, we all fell in love with him the first time around. Like, we cannot trash this man because let's face it, even the OG Caden, like his eyelashes and glasses are doing some very interesting stuff there. Uh, but even the OG Caden was a whole babe. However, I think we can all agree that new Caden, I love that he still has this like messy hair that's all in his face that you can imagine him con constantly like, Putting his hands through his hair to like get it all out of his face. Um, but wow. Look, I mean, look at this whole man. Like he's there getting his glasses out of his face so he can like take a listen to your heart because he's like in cardiology. And then just a whole man really. Just an absolute whole man. You know, like look at him go. He's secretly romantic. L literally secretly romantic. Look at him go. He's also sickness resistant. Do you know that about Caden? He can't get sick. And he can put Sims in a flirty mood with just one look. What? Caden, you absolute lord. You absolute lord. Okay, so we've got an updated um, indie, I think. I really like her. Like, I love her updated look. We never needed to do the head widening surgery. I think she looks pretty amazing. Oh, did we already do it to her? I don't know. I don't know. But she looks fab, and I really like her new look. Then we've got updated Violet, her twin sister. They've got the same overlays on, but they've got a few different things here and there that definitely give them a different look to each other. In fact, one thing I'm just gonna do real quick with her, just because I feel like her eyes are lying a little bit flat. And because I'm a perfectionist, I am just gonna... There. Just make her eyes pop a little bit more, you see that? It's just like some little sparkles there. I don't think it makes her eyes like sing a little bit more. So there we go, updated Violet as well, looking very, very cute. And then finally, <sighs> your, your screen may steam up here, but updated Caden as well, looking like a whole vibe, a very handsome vibe, a very handsome vibe. Let me know which one was your favorite. Uh, heal me, Caden. Well, indeed. X, 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 A, X, Danny, Six, and J Bourne. Welcome to the Peach Squad. I uh, hope you enjoy your peachy time here. And we've got, we've done. We've finished all three of them. We will be doing a raid, so don't worry. I'm also gonna go ahead and uh, upload these guys on the upload these guys to the gallery. I'm always in Hangul. Update twins and Caden. 
look at the look at this lot at the front. What is he doing? What is he even like? Hello, Daddy D, using some chia bits as well. Let's go ahead and uh, upload him onto the gallery so that you guys have him as well. Uh, and well, yeah, Whew. steamy, beautiful. I really, obviously, Caden, I think is probably my favorite makeover, but honestly, I also really, really like uh, Indy as well. I do really, really like Indy. I'm just checking to see, mods, do we have a raid person, potentially? Uh, we'll turn on Peachy so you can check your Peachy points as well. Uh, you guys are saying day is gone. That sounds really cool. Five nights at Freddy's. No. It's too scary. It's way too scary. If there's anybody that we've not raided yet that has a smaller channel, um, that would be my preference for uh, our raid today. Stick around because we'll go ahead and do that. I'm going to end the... Um, the What's it called? The YouTube video, but don't worry, I'm still going to be here in chat. Uh, I'll still be here. I'll still be here. Just give me one sec. Okay, just give me one sec. I get all confused. Thank you so much for watching. Those guys are on the gallery. Go and check them out now. I'll see you in another video. Bye.